I'm Alistair Rimmer, and this is Sponge Weekly, an amusing, enjoyable, exciting expression of exuberant entertainment. Oh yes, that's right, I am the cement between the bricks, the link man. I am indeed the missing link. Oh. Anyway, on with the show. Let's meet the main man, the man with the plan. Welcome, Paul Zerdin. And you're welcome to him. Hi, I'm Paul Zerdin, and thanks for tuning in. Oh. I thought he'd be doing a little bit longer than that. Well, um... Hello, Paul Zerdin here, and this is Sam. Hello, Sam here, and this is Paul Zerdin. I am a ventriloquist, which means that I can talk without moving my mouth, but I'm creating the illusion that the puppet is actually talking because I'm manipulating him. I am the puppet in question, and I'm helping the ventriloquist Paul Zerdin create the illusion that I'm actually talking. Although I am actually doing the talking. No, no, it's me that's doing the talking. What, and I'm just moving my mouth? Yeah, because if I stopped talking, Sam would be moving his mouth, but no sound would be coming out like this. See? And if Paul didn't stop talking and I didn't move my mouth, then you'd still hear my voice, but my mouth wouldn't be moving. Like this. You see? You can still hear my voice. You could be a ventriloquist. Oh, no thank you. Why not? Well, because ventriloquists are losers, destined to die alone. <gasps> do you really think so? Absolutely. I mean, I don't know why anyone would do a thing like this. A grown man talking to a doll? Where the hell is your dignity? Harsh. Harsh, but true, my friend. Well, do you think so? Oh, yes. Well, I, um, I, I don't think I can carry on. Yeah, well, we're in lockdown, Vinny. You can't go out. It reminds you of the war, except then you could go out, but you most likely get shot. Depends, of course, where you were. If you were on the beaches of Normandy, then you wouldn't want to go out, but you had to. Here, you can go out, they're only for essentials. You know, food, shoes, exercise, shoes. You need shoes, but there are no shoe shots open. Same as the war, no shoe shots, mainly because, well, we bombed theirs and they bombed ours. Not just shoe shots, you know, everything. I remember the little Jimmy Rafferty. Oh, can't remember why. Oh, all those lovely songs, we'll meet again. White Cliffs of Dover. I like big butts and I cannot lie. Yeah, that's right. Just like the war, except we don't have to wear a uniform. And you haven't got a big sergeant fella shouting at you. Hey, come on, fall in. Stand at ease. Left, right, left, right. That's no place for a hamster. They're just the same, really, COVID-19 and Hitler. Yeah, one's a nasty virus and the other was a small German bloke with a funny moustache. Don't want to catch one, but everyone wanted to catch the other. The closest they got was Charlie Chaplin. Oh yes, Jimmy Rafferty, he had a moustache. So anyway, stay in, keep safe. Soon we'll invade Europe and push the Hun back to China, which is where it all started. Keep calm and carry on. That's right. You haven't said much. <laughs> I couldn't get a word in. <laughs> For those of you who don't know, this is Baby. Yeah, Baby. That's right, Baby. Baby. Yes. Baby. Yes. What's that? What's what? That. That. Well, that's a camera. Camera? Yeah. Why camera? Well, because we are filming a show. Show? Yeah. Game? No. Show. Game? No. Game? No. Game? Okay. Okay. Let's play a game. Why not? Sure. Yeah. What game do you want to play? I Pie. That's I Spy. I Pie. Okay. Let's play I Pie. Do you want to start? No. Okay. I'll start. Yeah. Well, you're going to start? Yeah. Okay. All right, off you go. Yeah. Ready? You know the rules, don't you? Yeah. Rules. Yeah. Off you go. I pie rules. Yeah, the I pie rules. Go away. Go on. Yeah. I pie. When my little eye is something to do with S. S. Yes. Sky? No. Seat? No. Uh, spoon? Uh-uh. Saucer? No. Uh, sock? Uh-uh. Soap? No. Stick, huh? shoe, huh? shop, huh? soup, huh? slide, huh? sunglasses, huh? super glue. Uh -uh. Okay, um, I give up. Duck. Duck. Yeah, duck. Uh, beginning with S. Yeah. Right. How on? Uh, well, the thing is, duck. Yeah, how on? No, duck begins with D. D for duck. Yeah. Okay. So not S. Duck doesn't begin with S. Duck of one. No, duck. Ah! Okay. Okay. Ah! Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, you won. Yeah, I won. Ah! 
Okay, you go. Right, all right. Uh, I spy with minor lie, something beginning with, um, I don't know, G? Duck. No. Duck. No. Duck. No, duck doesn't begin with. Ah! Okay, it's duck. Well done, you. How on ties. Yes. Okay, you'll go. Okay, I buy with my little eyes, I'm in beginning with K. K? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah, K. All right, is it duck? No. It's duck, isn't it? No. It's duck? No, it's not duck. All right, I give up, what is it? Duck. Duck. Yeah, you're not very good at this game, are you? No. This is Alastair Rimmer with Alastair Rimmer's Top 5 with me, Alastair Rimmer. Yes, this is my own bit. I bring you the top 5 music tracks that complement the artists performing them. The tracks that artists should have sung. Coming in at number 5, Cupcakes for Toddlers, Little Mix. Do you get it? At number 4, I've had both my lips done, Dua Lipa. At number 3, answering an email about Anna, Rihanna. I like that one. And at number two, I think I've got cystitis, Sting. And finally at number one, a pop star has opened a bad supermarket, Louis Crapaldi. That's it, join me, Alistair Rimmer, again next week for another top five of top fives. That's it, I've got nothing more to say. You know, I can still remember the very first sweets given to me by my grandfather. They were Werther's original, and I was just a boy. I'll never forget that taste, sweet, creamy, and uncommonly good. I remember feeling I must be someone very special when my granddad gave me his wonderful butter candy. Now I'm a granddad, and what else would I give my grandson but Werther's original? He's someone very special too, you know. Oi, come back, you little sh**. So this is what we call Sam shout outs. Yeah! And so we're going to give you uh, a little mention here. This is first of all, uh, Catriona Griffin. Catriona Griffin! Do you have to shout so loud? Yeah! Why? It's my shout out! Okay. She says, please can you do a shout out for my children, Rachel 10. Rachel 10! Kian 9. Kian 9! Rob 7. Rob 7! And Charlie the dog. Charlie the dog! Oh, I'm not saying a shout out for a dog. And she said, that will be amazing. This will be a dream for the kids, especially Kian who loves puppets. Puppets? Yeah. What a loser. And does his own shows. And that's from uh, Catriona Griffin in Cork in Ireland. Yeah, Cork, Ireland. Sue Hassel Fuchs. Fuchs. Yes. Says, hi, Paul and Sam and all the family. Please say a very special hello to my grandsons as both have been isolating. My oldest grandson saw you a few years ago and he was in hysterics. Really? Can't believe it. Anyway, we've got to say a big hello to Cameron, aged eight. Cameron, aged eight. And we've got Ethan, aged five. Ethan, five. And that's a big thank you from their nanny. Nanny. In Gravesend. Gravesend in Kent. That's right. So, Carol Still, she says, please say a special hello to our daughter, Elizabeth. Elizabeth. Who is nearly seven. Seven. And absolutely adores Sam. Yeah, she loves me. Not you, but me. That's right. And Kaylee Jane Hayes, loved you and Sam ever since I was younger. I loved his voice. And I always thought you were so talented at throwing your voice. Didn't know you could do that. Yeah, what's this? Hello, hello, hello. That's very impressive. Thank you. You can contact us at Paul Zerdin Instagram, at Paul Zerdin Twitter, Facebook page Paul Zerdin, and don't forget to subscribe here to Paul Zerdin's YouTube channel. Yeah, do it now. We'd like to thank you for watching this first episode. See you next week. Bye. Bye. Zerdin takes no responsibility for any offence caused at any time. You take the risk by watching the show. Returns can be uplifting as well as depressing. Paul Zerdin's comedy is brought to you by him and a team of writers on a range of mainly legal substances.
Any complaints, call 0998-737-8241 because no one knows whose number that is. Anyway, tune in next week for Sponge Weekly with Paul Zerdin and, of course, me, Alistair Rimmer.